So I remember she always tell me like the reason why I'm so strong and big is because she put her secret ikan bilis in the <laughs> porridge. She grind it. At the age of I think 13, uh, that's when my Tourette's was at its peak. I remember like uh, going home one day like crying and I don't want to, I want to stop school and I don't want to just go outside, I just want to stay at home. And I remember my mom uh, being at home and being uh, uh, re reminding me that uh, you will get through this. I remember like during those hard times, she encouraged me that uh, it will get better with time. At that point of time, they directed me towards what I love, passion, which was martial arts. Every mom, like, they want you to pursue education first, but then uh, after a while, you know, my mom realized that I had more passion towards sports. So she was one of the unique moms in Singapore which allows me to pursue a career in sports. So because, you know, I mean, uh, sport, sports is a high risk career and you might make it or you might not make it. And in Singapore, there's no mixed martial artist that that actually make a living that can support the entire family and like yeah basically make a career out of it so i i felt i was the pioneer of it and I, I believe in myself and thankfully my mom my dad my parents my family they all believe in me as well i'm not a strict mother uh, i'm a very understanding mother uh, and i'm a very supportive mother I would say she's a very selfless mother. I mean, yeah. something to describe, you know? She, she puts the needs of children first. Yeah. Uh, caring and loving towards the family, yeah. Sometimes during trainings, I some, get some kind of injuries, you know, bruise and stuff. And then I can see the fire lit, her, lit in her eyes, trying to heal me up and stuff. So I feel her being a nurse, it's her identity and it's something she loves and tries for. Growing up, we are not so like, I don't know, we don't really show our affection through words, but I want, I want to say, you know, like, I really appreciate whatever you've been doing over these years and I really, really love you, you know. After all these years, they appreciate you and when they grow up, they are so caring and loving towards you. They support you all the way. So that's the best joy of a mother. <laughs>